Hi, this is Mato. Welcome to my online chess lecture. In this video I will show you a game between Levon Aronian and Sergei Kayakin. This amazing rapid chess game was played in Belgium in 2018. Levon Aronian had white pieces and he started with e4. Sergei Kayakin played e5. Knight to f3, knight to c6, bishop to c4, the Italian game. Bishop to c5 and the Aronian castle at kingside. Knight to f6 attacking the pawn on e4, defending d6. White to move. Rook to e1 was played. c3 and h3 are the two most played moves. Rook to e1 was played. There was a game in 2006 from Gibraltar Masters tournament when black played knight to g4. And after rook to e2, h6, and player with the black pieces went on to win the game. Back to our game. Rook to e1, a6, c3, h6, preventing bishop to g5, knight from b to d2, Karyakin, castle kingside, bishop to b3, intending bishop to c2, bishop to a7, knight to f1, Rook to e8, knight to g3, bishop to e6, not exchanging bishops, bishop to c2, d5. Black is doing well in the opening. e takes on d5, queen takes on d5 is also a good move, bishop takes on d5 was played. Bishop to e3, bishop takes on e3, rook takes on e3, queen to d7, knight to g4 also comes to mind. And if rook to e1, queen to d6, queen to d7 was played, h3, controlling a g4 square, rook to e7, queen to d2, rook from a to e8, rook from a to e1, g6, knight to h4, tempting black to take on a2, Karyakin played knight to h7. Is bishop takes on a2 possible? If bishop takes on a2 and white plays b3, then knight to a5. Knight to h7 was played. This is a very interesting moment of the game. It is a white to move. Knight to h5. Black to move. What would you do? Would you take the knight on h5 or not? Kriakin did not. He played king to h8. What happens if pawn takes knight? Let's have a look. If pawn takes knight, then rook to g3 check. And after king to h8, queen takes on h6. And if rook to g8, d4. The position is extremely unpleasant for black. Back to our game. King to h8 was played. d4. Black to move. This is now the most critical position of the game. Can black take on h5 or not? If black can safely take on h5, then black is winning. So this requires some calculations. Kriakin captured the knight. Rook to g3. Rook to e6. d takes on e5. Queen to d8. Attacking the knight on h4, knight to f5, knight takes on e5, rook to g7, black to move in this position. Karyakin played very cool move. What is it? What would you do in this position if you had black pieces? The move is knight to f3 check. Pawn takes knight. Rook takes on e1 check, king to h2, black to move. Black, play the move and white resigned. Please pause and find the winning move by black. Did you pause? What did you find? The move is rook to h1 check. Aronian resigned. If king goes to g3, then h4. And after knight takes on h4, check. King goes to h2, rook takes on g7. And what else? 
if king takes the rook, then then the king is on the light squares, and that means that bishop takes on f3 with check. After king goes to h2, queen takes queen. What a game! What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.